ladies and gentlemen, Lynette Woodard. Lynette is presented by the owner and chairman of the Harlem Grove Charters, Manny Jackson. Thank you very much. Uh, wow, it's such an honor to be here. I'd like to thank the Hall of Fame for this, this wonderful, wonderful uh, moment in my life. Um, it's a time for celebration, and it's time for me to share with uh, others uh, and the support, uh, to recognize them for the support that they've given me throughout my career. So I would like to, first of all, um, congratulate the other inductees. Um, and I'd like to thank my family for being here, my wonderful mother, who uh, just allowed me to play when I was growing up. You know, she didn't burden me down with a lot of chores. She just said, go, baby, you do your thing. <laughs> I thank you, and I love you for that. Um, I'd like to recognize my sisters who are here with me, uh, Donna and Bonnie. I have other relatives here, Monica and Josie. Um, and Josie, I'll have to uh, say that you did discover me for Kansas, so I, I want she to, she wanted me to make sure that I mentioned that. Uh, but also, I would like to recognize uh, my brother, uh, because without him, uh, I don't know if I would have played the game of basketball. Uh, he's a couple of years older than I am, and uh, we were close in age, so whatever game he played, I played that particular day. And one day he introduced me uh, to what we call basketball now, but actually it was sock ball. We'd roll our socks together and shoot behind the bedroom door. But uh, when my parents figured out what we were doing, they kicked us out of the house and bought us a goal and a hoop, and we were out in the backyard from uh, that day forward. But I thank him for allowing me to uh, play with him and for him teaching me the game of basketball. Um, I would like to thank... Uh, <laughs> I would like to thank uh, my hometown, Wichita, Kansas, for all the support that they've given me over the years. Um, also, the state of Kansas. Um, you know, just when you have so many friends and family reaching out to you, encouraging you, uh, it just makes things so much easier. Um, I would like to thank the University of Kansas uh, for a wonderful education, uh, for uh, giving me the opportunity uh, to play there. Uh, I would like to give a special thanks to uh, my coach, Coach Washington, who uh, really showed me what courage was all about, who fought for many years so that women could have the opportunity there uh, to play basketball. Thank you. There are a couple other names I would like to mention uh, from our sports information uh, department. Uh, people have been very supportive, uh, Doug Vance, uh, Bo White, uh, who got things together to uh, present it to the Hall of Fame, and uh, I would like to thank him. I don't know if he's here tonight, but um, I, I really do appreciate that. I would like to thank uh, also Bill Wall and USA Basketball for the years of opportunity that they gave me to compete at the international level, uh, which brought me to the Olympic experience. and. Um, you know, to win a gold medal, to play the game that you love, to represent your co country, uh, it's just, it's nothing like it. And I thank him for all of his efforts, for believing in the women's game uh, to allow us to uh, be able to realize our dreams. And with that opportunity, uh, I got the opportunity to uh, be welcomed into a, a dream of mine, and that was to play for the Harlem Globetrotters. Uh, right after the 84 Olympic Games, uh, the Globetrotters being the innovators that they are, uh, they said, you know, women can play this game. And they opened the doors, um, you know, for uh, women to come into the game. And it was very fortunate and a, a dream of mine uh, for it to happen. I had quite an inspiration. Uh, you saw him earlier on the film, Geese Osby, uh, who is my cousin. I watched him for 24 years. And uh, he inspired me then. He continues to inspire me. But that was my connection. And um, wow, for that to happen, you know, I, I can only uh, say thank God. I would also uh, like to thank uh, all of my teammates uh, from over the years, 
uh, thank uh, the folks overseas who helped me uh, keep my career together uh, as we waited so patiently uh, for the WNBA. And also, I would like to say thank you to Bal Ackerman, to Renee Brown, um, for giving uh, the older players a chance to come back to the league. Uh, there have been many days and nights uh, that I was overseas that I would say, wow, I wish we could do this in the United States. And finally it happened. Although it came at the end of my career, it was just um, great to have the opportunity uh, to play in that league. Uh, last but not least, we only have a short time. Um, but I'd like to thank God for all of his blessings because without him, I mean, uh, I could do nothing. And uh, I just thank my mom for uh, instilling that in me. She told me that, you know, God can, he can do the unimaginable. And that's what this evening is for me. I could have never dreamed it. Uh, it's a wonderful, wonderful feeling. Uh, I walk two steps, I float the next two. So I'm not really sure if I'm walking. <laughs> but um, anyway, it's just been great. And uh, I thank all of you. And um, thank you very much. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.